Happy Tuesday! Good morning! We are going to learn our second letter of the week. Let's review all the ones we already know. This is a big stack. Ready? S is a snake. D is a dog with a tail. D -d -d -d. Q is a queen. Qu -qu -qu -qu. E is an elephant. Eh, eh, eh. C is a cookie with a bite taken out of it. O is Ollie Octopus. Ah, ah, ah. K kicks. L is a lamp. Ooh, ooh, ooh. U is an umbrella. Ah, ah, ah. F is a feather. J jumps. J, j, j. T is tippy toes. T, t, t. G is a goat. G, g, g. A is an apple on a branch. Ah, ah, ah. I is itchy. I, I, I. R is a rainbow. Er, er, er. N is a needle and thread. Mm, mm, mm. M has mountains. Mm, mm, mm. H is a house with a tall chimney. <sighs> B is a bat and ball. B, b, b. P is a puppet. P, p, p. V is a vase. V, v, v. Okay. This next letter makes me so sleepy. Ooh. Oh, so sorry about that. It just makes me, just thinking about it, it makes me sleepy. Do you want to know why it makes me sleepy? Let me show you and see if you can figure it out. This is our next letter. Hmm, what do you think that boy's doing? Oh, he's yawning. That's why this letter makes me sleepy, is because of why yawns. Why yawns? And did you know a yawn is contagious? That means you can catch it. So I bet when I was just yawning, you started yawning too. So this is the letter Y, Y, yawns. Can you say yawns? It's kind of a funny word, yawns. What do we get at the beginning of yawns? Yeah, yeah. Now, let me tell you a little something about this, this letter. It tries to be tricky because if you say why, you might think it makes the w sound, but it doesn't. It makes the y, y sound. So you gotta be smarter than this letter. It tries to trick you. Remember, just like G, j, j, tries to trick you too? We got all these tricky letters, but they don't know how smart you are, right? Okay, so this is our new letter. Y yawns. Y, y, y. Now your turn, ready? Good job. Now let me show you how to write it. Here's my whiteboard. Got a brand new marker this time, so it shouldn't give me any issues. So the last one we did was V, and you went slant down and up. So we're going to take that same motion, slant down and up. And then we're going to go down, down, down. And it has a tail. So watch again. Slant down, up, down, down, down. Slant down, up, down, down, down. Okay, you ready to try it? Okay, riding arm out. Slant down, up, down, down, down. Slant down. Down, down, down. One more time. Slant down, up, down, down, down. Okay, now let's practice tracing it. So we have three arrows here showing you what to do. So we're gonna start here, slant down, stop at the dot, up, and down, down, down. Here's my crayons. You can use markers, crayons, color pencils, whatever your parents or your grown up allows, okay? So ready? Slant down, up, down, down, down. Slant down, up, down, 
down, down, down. Ooh, I like how it looked so far. I can't use that color. Slant down, up, down, down, down. Slant down, up, down, down, down. It's getting pretty full, isn't it? Ooh, here's pink, my favorite. Slant down, up, down, down, down. There we go, there's my letter Y. And this letter says, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good job, you're not gonna let it trick you, are you? You're too smart for that. Okay. So here's my new card. Y yawned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is where we're gonna stop for today and tomorrow we'll practice it on our whiteboard and do the practice page, okay? Hope you guys have a terrific Tuesday and I'll see you soon.